Hey guys. Uh, you know, I screwed up. I screwed up. I probably could stop that sun from coming in. But then I'd have to change the curve again. And I don't want to do that. So, next time I record, it'll be at night time. That way you don't have, well not, not like late night, but you know, a little bit darker. That way you could see this part of the screen over here. Uh, sorry to have it like that right now. But you know, I already have everything set up, so I might as well get through with this. Um, oh, that's nice. I forget that uh, having a, when you have your computer hooked to a big TV, it kind of, Huh? Oh, can you shut the door? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll oh. Well, when you have a computer hooked up to a big TV, it's going to have these like little glitches where sometimes it might shut, uh, not shut down, but uh, they might cut the screen off a little bit sometimes. So yeah, as you can see, I bought some games here, and right now I bought these. Lay down, buddy. Lay down. Yeah, I know you want to come over here, so lay down. Lay down. Come on, buddy. Lay down so I can get this done. Thank you. Sorry, that was my blind dog, buddy. Okay, so I got these games over here. Two of them didn't work, which is sad. But when I get a better computer, I'll be able to play these games, like Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator, which is uh, you can make wars from uh, people... People, like people create people like uh, like I was gonna do like some kind of zombie story with this game or something I don't know I was gonna do some cool stuff I, oh yeah that's what it was I was gonna do uh like actual wars oh that's nice boy now I'm gonna have to move you when I get up get in my door so yeah I was gonna do like something like okay you're still recording I forget with this camera, something happened to it. Every five minutes, it'll stop recording. So yeah, that's why I, you know it is what it is. So Epic Bell, yeah, that that game. When I get a better computer, we'll have this cool uh, country versus country. That's what I'm trying to think of, like actual war. I've been saying war, trying to think of another name for war. That's why it was hard, my bad people. Like, what's the name for actual war? I don't know, war. <laughs> uh, or world war. There you go. And then I got this game, which kind of works, but with the better computer, it'd be a lot better and smoother. Right now, it's very hard to get through on one player. So, I'm looking for people to play Zombie Army Trilogy with, and that way we can go through the maps on that. So, I just gotta find people for that one. Buddy, quit over here whining and he, he loves the camera so and then we got Uno and um, Uno this game do not buy don't buy this game I really like you could get these trading cards for it but if that's if you get the game to work this game was such a disappointment buddy quit and um so yeah, don't buy this game. This game's awful. I mean, it's not the game. Uno's fun. Uno's really fun. And if this game actually worked, it would be really fun because there's a lot of things you can buy with it. The change the cards, uh, like it would still be Uno, but it'd be like a different style of Uno, like you get movie themed or cartoon themed, you know. And that that'd be really fun to play. Even on with the computers, I'd love to record this game for you all. Uh, even with the four computers playing, but the, even with the four computers, it doesn't work. And if you do get this game, uh, if you manage to get this game to work, well, good for you. Because when you get this game, you have to get this app called uh, Uplay right there. Uplay. I don't suggest it. I don't suggest it. Because all the app does is open this game up, and, and then the game doesn't even work. It doesn't work online it doesn't work offline and so I was very disappointed with this the whole reason why I bought it was because it was multiplayer it was uno and that's why I bought it but 
I couldn't, you know. Hopefully in the future, maybe I don't know. Maybe I could find out the problem. Because it, it can't, I mean, it can't just be me, but it probably, I probably installed it somehow wrong. Oh, here we go, crash issues. This is important. Yeah, see, they need to update it. If they update it, it'll be probably better. Um, then we got this, I bought this game, Madness Cubed, which, um, I was expecting a building game, honestly, with this. And it wasn't a building game. It was more like a survival slash and, and oh but but by the way I got so lucky I uh, when I bought this game of course I tried it out to make sure it worked and you know so I could know if I could record it for you guys or not but uh making sure you're still recording but when I got it so yeah I was expecting this uh, uh open world build game but it wasn't open well it could be open world if you open I don't know it's weird it's very weird when we get into it you'll see I, this is a cool game though. I do suggest it. In fact, there's one person on here who's like, it's a cool game, but every time I get on, only Russians are playing. And then so I messaged them and I was like, look, now when I get on it, you can get on it too. Or we, like, or when I see you on there, I'll pop on there. And then, you know, we could team up, make a world, a, a, a survival world or something. That'd be nice. Then I got Left 4 Dead 2, once again. Uh, I'm a big fan of this game, especially, I mean, even back then on, for the Xbox 360, uh, I love this game. I could spend hours just going through the maps, and that back then there was only uh, four or five maps uh, with, and in the inside those maps there was like uh, four or five parts too, so, so, but still, you know, I could still be, I don't, I always have fun playing that versus... I remember getting it when it first came out actually it was Christmas time and when I got it we were all talking and we were playing I was playing in the versus lobby and it was cool because it, in the Left 4 Dead 1 they didn't they never had versus so this was the first time and um and yet like we were all like oh wow this is awesome but we all got lost as zombies that was a funny thing because the game was so new no one knew the map at all so <laughs> When we spawned in as zombies, it kind of spawned you off in the distance on the Xbox 360 in front of people, not uh, inside them. <clears throat> or no, they probably didn't spawn you inside them and you had to run off and hide somewhere. But once we would go and hide, we'd get lost instantly. You couldn't see your teammate through the wall, so we were like, oh crap, what do we do? We're just going to die here. <laughs> That's what happened. It was fun though, still. So. Then we got this game, Cubic Castle. I'm going to be... I'm not going to be showing this till more of the end of the series because I want to be able to build something like as you see up here I actually have something good going already and that's just for the start base. I, uh, maybe when I buy the first uh, giant world I'll show you guys how I uh, buy worlds and such but I don't want to show you guys the beginning of it when playing this game because it's very boring. It's a lot of farming. It, you don't want to see me just mining the whole time because that's all this game is at first and then but when you get your place built and uh, enough material made for when you can uh, start to explore I mean explore and uh, play PvP battles and then go to these shops as you can see here these are shops which is cool how they have that that'd be cool to see I haven't seen one of those yet they I probably have to farm in this place anyways so uh, right now we're going to go with this top game here and this is Construction Machine Simulator 2016. Whew. I know it took 10 minutes to explain what's going on and these are only the first set of games. Uh, we're actually not going to even get to this first game yet because I still got one more thing I got to tell you guys that, you, you're, that you're going to like. And this is the deal with the store and me uh, playing I think new games. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's probably nice. We can get Midnight Land right now. No. <laughs> that's what I hate about this. It's so addicting. Once you get one game, it's like, okay, I got 20 bucks left. What else can I get? <laughs> that's, that's part of it. Oh, man. Here we go again with this music. I'm trying to go to the store. Hold on. There we go.
Yeah, hopefully we don't have this problem when it comes to playing games. We do their Doom Eternal. Okay, so um, well, I was gonna tell you guys, if you want to suggest a game to me, this is how you're gonna, this is how you're able to suggest the game. These are only only suggestions I'm gonna take. So, what you're gonna do is you go pick whatever uh simulate or uh, genre you want in the game store on the Steam. And you could do this even without account. You could go to a website and do this. But right now I'm doing it on the app. That's why it looks kind of different. Uh, we'll use Adventure, for example. And once you go here, uh, click another narrow by tag over here. You'll see some other options. And click one of those options to narrow it down for yourself. Not, but this also to do it. This is what you need to do. You have to do this to get to what I'm trying to show you. Uh, so we got adventure. Let's add some action, and then um, and then you go this narrow by price, and because once you narrow it down twice, they're going to give you uh, the narrow by price option. That's what we want to get, and once we get that, under five dollars. <laughs> Don't worry. The next, like I'm doing this for the first set of games. When 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 you guys suggest two good games, then we're going to go up by fifteen dollars and then you guys will be able to suggest games under fifteen dollars but right now just do it by five dollars and then I wanna once you guys get a good game that you could uh, what what's a good game considered to me in this channel um, a good game is um let me hear the name So a good game is like sorry those are scammers or something they try and do the Apple scam. So once you get guys suggest two good games, um, then I will move up to the fifteen dollar range. Okay. So, jeez, is it gonna be stuck on the machine mode? That's weird. That's a horrible scammer. That's messed up. Anyways, um, yeah. So under five dollars, and if you go on right now, you'll see some good games. Honestly, uh, until March twenty six, there's gonna be some good games on sale right now. And so if you suggest some games right now, and I'll pick them up on uh. Hopefully I can get them on Thursday. I don't know, maybe Wednesday. But if it's really good, like if it's like on that sale, you see these games are 90% off, 66% off, 85% off. These are really, and you see all those green tags, those are the sale games. Uh, don't, but don't mind these. Don't suggest something with a purple tag on the, the picture there because those are DLC packs and those are just uh, things for the games and so those are not what we're looking for we're looking just for games not for DLC packs um, if you guys don't suggest any games I'll probably be getting uh, this game uh, this South Park game fractured the fractured butthole because this I'm a South Park fan and right now this, you, one thing. you don't want to go down that road <laughs> That's so far. And then so right now it's on sale. So if you guys don't suggest anything, I might get this sell because look, this fifty dollar game right now is only thirteen bucks. Well, plus tax, that's like fourteen bucks. And then if you want the gold edition DLC, which is um, a map pack and then also a season pass. So anything that comes out, like the cream crunch, or purple crunch guy or and then there's that uh, the camp one that I think there's two map packs out for it right now uh, but yeah so I might be getting that and that ends March 26 I think this has to do with a uh, st. Patrick's Day and yeah so yeah even if you guys aren't suggesting games I would suggest to you guys to go on here and check out these price ranges like just do it 35 and under and you'll see 
like some really good games like look at this Grand Theft Auto 5 this is thirty dollars but right now it's fifteen like sixteen bucks right now that's a good deal that's like that's like if it was used but it's not used it's online it's a PC game um, yeah it's so insane uh, Assassin's Creed if you like those games I'd suggest you really check it out because all the Assassin's Creed games or also uh, Creed games like uh, really good Creed games that are off brand but still good uh, they got all the Assassin's Creed games for sale right now for very cheap and um, this Resident Evil Biohazard 7 and said 30 bucks it's 15 bucks you know 16 but yeah, so yeah, so um, if you want to suggest a game, remember, you got to go to the games, go to uh, pick a genre, like do RPG or any game, any genre you want, ma massively multiplayer, anything. And because if I see that the game won't work for my uh, device I have right now, then I won't be getting it. I, but I'll let you guys know that I can't get it right now, uh, too. Oh yeah, and then once you pick a genre, you gotta pick a second genre after scrolling down to half the page, I would say. And then, and then you would see the narrow by price option finally. And then narrow under five bucks, go through here and look at um whatever game that doesn't have this purple DLC tag. If it doesn't have this purple DLC get tag, you can suggest it. I'll look at it, and then if I like it. If I like what I see, then it's going to be bought. Um, look at this. Uh, this is a this is the most crazy one. Before we get before we go, okay. Borderlands three. Uh, first of all, I did. Borderlands. Oh, it's fifty bucks right now. I thought I seen it on sale. What is that? Oh, it probably went off sale last week. Oh, crap. See, th this one already went off sale. But, um, uh, like, this Wednesday, or this Tuesday, it was on sale. It, instead of 60 bucks, it was honestly, it was 15 bucks. That's how crazy these sales are. You gotta watch the store. And you might, or what you could do is, a good idea is you could follow a game that you really like and if it's really pricey you follow it and then it when it goes on sale it'll let you know um also I'm thinking about getting one of these uh video productions is it I don't know one of these apps that let me uh, record the game screen and with my webcam so you guys could see the game screen way more clear and also myself I think they're around 15 bucks but uh this hit video pad I don't know software software hub I hope it doesn't show anything Jeez, that's the thing about Steam guys if you have an account well you know I don't know how to turn that off there, there is a way to turn that off like the adult mode but I don't know. I don't think they would show anything in the store. But then again, you never know. So, yeah, we'll be getting an app. Or, I guess it's a game. I don't know how that's going to work, honestly. I think that's a scam when I think about it. Because how are you going to run this app and a game if you only could run one game at a time on this site? So, um, yeah, let's see you guys later and if you made it this far in the video let me give you a little taste of what's to come at the very end of the series yeah if you made it 20 minutes you think you deserve this let me move it to this side so you guys can see it a little bit oh, even with let's see Uh, shoot. What is my name? 
Oh yeah. Please don't tell me. Yes, I did it. Look at this. This is a funny thing. Right now I have this dress on. <laughs> Just because it goes with this alien hat. And then I'm going to add a green shirt with that. I haven't got time. I see I have been. Even though it looks like I made a lot. This is my home right now. And even though it looks like I made a lot. It's just, it's not. Look at it. We that's pretty cool steps I got right there. I got a nice pond right here. This is like the first thing I built is was this shed. And then I built this. Well, I kind of built these two at the same time. I think I finished this pond before I finished this house, though. And this house isn't even finished yet into roof. But I haven't, I'm not going to make the roof yet because I need special foam that, um, oh, let's see what we got. We got music, though. You know what the music note does, don't you guys? It goes... <laughs> that's what it does. <laughs> when you, um... Uh, <laughs> that's kind of why I have a mute on this, but... When we do this, when I show you guys this uh, game, I'm probably going to have music already played. Like, you know, royalty free kind of deal. Let's see. You know what? If you guys, here's an extra hint. In my next video, not next video, but like in the third video, we're going to see what's in this rare green cube. Because, look, this, this takes uh, 24 hours to get. And this takes 4 hours to get. The red ones, the purple ones are 24 hours. The green ones, I think they're 48 hours. We'll see. Oh, shoot. No, it's 180. 100 and... Why do I keep jumping? It's like I, every time I see a huge number, I get kind of scared and I jump. <laughs> it's 167 hours right now. It was 100 and... That was weird. I think it jumped an hour because I was jumping on top of it. I don't know. Did that actually happen? Okay, no, that didn't work. Um, when I do show you this game, guys, there's here's another hint. When I show you this game, you're going to hear some crazy stories about this game. Like, there is, a, like, I believe this game is probably, or was probably cursed in the past. I haven't seen it happen anymore. But there is something very, or something that scared me about this game when I, because I played this game when it first came out. But something happened, and uh, it made it like 3,000 and something days till I could play again. <laughs> and so um, those 3,000 days are up, <laughs> and I'm back. I lost a lot of worlds, a lot. See, uh, I want to show you guys. I want to show you guys this game because I really like it, and I would suggest it. Even, but you gotta be really careful on it. Once you get banned, it's it's like they give you warnings. They they give you two warnings, and then it's like a three thousand day ban, or I think it was four three thousand five hundred days or something. It's like a prison sentence. Honestly, it is. It's not worth the ban. It's it's an IP ban too. So, um, let's see here. What was I gonna show you? Once I get enough for these rooms here. See, uh, the small room is 1,000 uh, points. Right now I have 600. But once I get enough for these huge size, or actually what I like to do is I go here to custom, go max that's 100. Because this is bigger than huge. This is one more cubit bigger than huge. See, 5K. And when you go to huge, it's like 4,000. Or 700. But, yeah, so 5K room. Once I get that big room, and that's a huge room. Honestly, it takes a while to walk. Oh, I closed it. It takes a while to walk around in it and such. So, like, it's it's going to take me a while to build it in there. But, before I get that room, I'm going to buy a smaller room. More like a medium-sized room, which is around 2K. And that will be like a shop. 
or a farm room, a farm room, and that way I can get a lot of supplies, and then I'll get another room that's a small room, and that'll be a shop room, and then I'll get the huge 5K room because that's how you're supposed to do this game. And but you know what? By the time I get that uh, the farm room, after I get the farm room built, then I'll have you guys looking what I've done, and we'll probably go pick up from there because then that's like less farming and more adventuring and I still haven't done the quest so you guys could see that too and see what you and actually if you watch that series or you watch that part of the series you're going to learn how to get to those quests and get the XP level up quicker that's what you need so yeah look at how creepy this is I didn't realize this look at this this guy with the black mask and white I think that's the Grim Reaper mask honestly and he has black wings on black shirt black pants and he's just standing there what's his name his name is Horus H-O-R-U-S from the UK he's a cool dude if he created this game most likely he didn't but <laughs> that's a good picture so um yeah guys oh and Let's see. Which one is it? I mean, let me explain this since I, so I don't have to explain it later when we pick up, when we grab or pick on the Life for Dead 2 series. Right now I'm waiting for like a team, kind of gathering a team for Left 4 Dead 2. Oh, I almost dropped my keyboard. Left 4 Dead 2 and Zombie Army Trilogy. Zombie Army Trilogy later. Left 4 Dead 2 sooner. Um. Yeah, once I get that team going, then we can go on the custom maps, and we'll beat those. We'll show you guys what the custom maps look like. Uh, we'll probably do like a little series with Left 4 Dead 2, since the uh, epidemic we got going on right now. And I have a bunch of ideas, and when I play games, you, you guys will see I get into games. Like, I'm like, oh crap. Like, if, if I was in this situation right here, I'd be like, oh, God, where's my team at? Where's my team? And then I'd realize, oh, they're behind me. But I wouldn't see that because I'd be looking at this clown charging at me. Um, oh, what was I going to tell you guys? It's a discussion community. Uh, so I'm going to show you guys what, we, what I have done to the game for when we do go on it. Or what I'm trying to do right now. This is the right one. Workshop. <coughs> okay. There we go. <sighs> so, subscribe to item. I'll show you what I got so far. Tony Scarface, Montana. He replaces um, Bill in the game for what? For the Left 4 Dead 1 maps, or whoever uses Bill in their map, I, I would have Tony Scarface instead. Then I got the Trump, Donald, Donald Trump tank. So instead of seeing a tank, I would see Donald Trump, <laughs> and it would be making uh, quotes that Donald Trump said too. Winter blue water. I don't know what that is. Oh, oh yeah, that's like that. That's to change all the water on the map, so it won't be green and mucky, and so it'll be like clear blue water. I thought it'd be easier to see, so I, it's kind of cheap, but you know, why not? Evil. It, this replaces the 22 race car with the Evil Knievels race car. That's pretty cool. Tenacious D concert. This just replaces the music. Uh, for, wow, I guess a whole zombie thing. Huh. Okay, so yeah, that makes Tenacious D music when zombies attack. I thought it was only for the concert stage, but I think it's for the whole game. <laughs> I might have to change that one. See, that's why I have to wait to show you guys this game, because I want to get everything set up and working. Some of these actually don't work, and they won't show you what they're supposed to be. Uh, then we got this DWU K2 desert rifle. Oh, this replaces the desert rifle. 
This is what replaces it as a rifle, a scar. <laughs> oh. Wait, does that replace it? I thought that replaced the sniper. Oh, okay, so we got this brush axe. I thought that looked pretty cool. And if it's the same people, I'm just going to go hang out. And then in case if I don't feel like playing with it. case, if I don't feel like using the trunk tank, I'll use uh, the Santa tank. And here's the Santa tank right here. Okay. The steel baton. This replaces the nightstick with the steel baton. I thought that's pretty cool. Got another one. And then and then this replaces a baseball bat with Harley Quinn's baseball bat. This was actually a hard decision to make replacing these items because oh this this is for the donation thing. Um yeah, it's really hard to decide to play replacing these items because I can get the item the baseball bat from uh what's that movie uh Friday the 13th and they, they even replace a baseball bat with other things too, like stuff that's not a baseball bat. Um, then I have a, um, for like when we do the, the Chinese maps, I could do, um, I could give uh, the characters face masks. So they all, have, the Left 4 Dead 1 characters have face masks. And that's from the Division game, I don't know what the Division game is. Uh, this replaces the van with the Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine. I thought that'd be pretty cool. And, oh, this is one, this one I like. But, I, I always suggest to people that make this kind of stuff, I'm like, can you guys make like a bowl or something that you could smoke and you blow smoke out when you heal? I think that'd look a lot much better than this. But, this is good enough as it is. Uh, because that would be a lot of work what I'm asking for. Uh, so someone changed the color to look like nugs of uh, weed and then they put this little weed patch on here with the over the health symbol so you got a weed bag and then uh, for the uh, vial jars I have bags of vials like as if it was like scooped up I like that idea I think of them as ghetto vial jars <laughs> M16 the weed model it's just a thing, look cool. I'd probably end up changing that because it doesn't really look like I could change it with something that looks like a whole new gun. Instead, I put a skin on it, so I probably out like. That. And then I have a um, Rocky Balboa for Nick that replaces Nick, and then I have Apollo Creed that replaces Coach. So that since they're both from Left 4 Dead 2, if I use one of them, I probably use the other one, of course. I got Stewie Griffin for Ellis. Uh, Stimpy, Rick Sanchez for Nick. See, some of these I have to take out because, um, and there's Shaggy. Of course, I put Shaggy in here for Ellis because, um, you can't have the same character playing two characters. That'd be nice if it randomly picks it, but it doesn't do that. So, I might, I might have to take some out. I put, uh, Kagome from Inuyasha. I wish they had Inuyasha, then I'd get him. But they, I couldn't find him yet. I think they had him. I just can't find him. Uh, the gold, the gnome is gold. I said gold. No, the gnome. Uh, shotgun spaz. Twelve. Oh yeah, the shotgun spaz. I got that gold edition. See, I put a skin on that too. I probably end up changing that too. I think I'm gonna change that with like a portal gun or something. Because I like the look, I used that last time and that looked cool, it had plasma blast and everything. Oh, here's one of my favorite, the Shining Axe. So this is the axe from the Shining. And it replaces a regular axe. And it's like, instead of the Fireman Axe, you got this Shining Axe. That's, that's from the movie. See? They even have this to show you. <laughs> that's pretty decent.
Oh, and this one I like too. Coach at Spalding. I love that one, but they 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 were share they share such a sim and plus he's black. I didn't realize that till now. That's why they share such a semblance. I thought, you know, I thought it was just me. When I seen Coach go down in it, I finally realized, oh yeah, I put the Captain Spalding uh, outfit on him. I didn't realize it just changed his head. Hold on. to be racist, honestly. In this video, oh well. Oh, I spelled honestly wrong, oh well. I, I got rid of Grammarly, I don't like it. It slows the stuff down, so why if people don't like my typing, then, you know, I just, I don't care if people complain, so I don't even know I got in the first place for a little bit. <laughs> okay, Creepy Susie for Zoe. That one I like, too, because I like the movie, uh, what is this? Huh, I don't know what that is. But, um, that's from the show Oblong, the cartoon from 2005 to 2007 or something. Uh, here's a golden revolver. I like this one a lot. It replaces uh, the magnum. So I guess it's strong. I thought that was a dead seagull. Oh, and then I got these female CD, CD agents, but I haven't seen them yet. This one doesn't work. We're gonna get rid of this one, actually. Yeah, this one.